Disney is continuing to take more losses as well. So South Carolina, one of the biggest states for Disney, considering they have a whole resort now. Okay, guess what? South Carolina state president says they're not going to be investing in Disney anymore. It really shows you that, you know, people are sick of the far-left activism that Disney is taking place. And people are like, really? Activism is good. You know, they would always say that, blah, blah, blah. But everybody knows that Disney is going too far. Okay, Walt Disney Company is going too far with their activism. And they're really paying the price, almost certainly. Okay, even like, you know, most normal YouTubers who are not part of the quote-unquote culture war are even seeing this for themselves. The Disney box, Disney's even seen it with, with the box office numbers. The absolute double whammy failures of Riss and the Marvels, they had to delay all the movies until 2025 because they because they wanted to have the only the big movies to say, hey, oh, remember The Lion King? Remember Deadpool? Remember Inside Out? Okay, you know, we, we must get you back on board of Disney. Okay. But it's enough is enough with Disney. Okay, enough is enough for Disney. Okay. Disney has basically killed themselves. Okay. Disney Plus is dying. Okay. Disney parks, no one was going down, okay? But they realize it can't be fixed. It does not bode well for Disney, of course. You know, again, Disney still not listening to Twitter activists. I, we have been telling them for, you know, years, but no, 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 no. They, they want to they wanna please the activists. They want to make them happy. They're not going to listen to everybody else. They're going to only listen to... Because these Twitter activists or these activists that want Disney are only 10% of the population. Okay, so Disney is making movies for only 10% of the population, okay, that is not good, okay, because that means the box office numbers for anything is going to be very low, okay, because those are the only people going to be watching your movies, okay, and 10% of the population people, but it can still be a massive success, but these people don't go see in movies, that's the thing, these people don't go see movies, okay, and... The state's banker, Waftus, a Republican, manages approximately 70 billion a year. The state treasurer's office contains 105 million dollars of Disney debt instruments that were matured, scheduled, and will not be replaced. The ESG, when which Craig Sewer's ripple activity masquerading as corporate responsibility, has ruined Disney. The ESG has nothing to do with investing. ESG is a species of behavior created by the left and driven to everybody else to basically force their ideals on people. Okay. So Disney has a lot of problems right now. They have, you know, massive box office flops, losing billions of dollars on the movies, losing millions of dollars on Disney Plus. They're being sued by ten thousand women for pay gap. Was you know, you would think that the wokest of woke companies would, you know, make so men and women are equal in the comp in their own company themselves. And as a Trinidad Swatch in America, we all grew up on Disney. Okay. And don't tell me you didn't. Don't tell me you didn't grow up on watching those old Disney movies. Unless you didn't like Disney movies. But. Okay. But. Disney of course halted advertising on Elon Musk's X. The social ma- you know. Far right advocacy group. And since the ads contained films and anti-Semitic content. So on and taste and every other. Planned to fight the battle and quote. Claiming the algorithms governing the user experience were manipulated. Also this is the same. And also Elon Musk unbanned. I think. Unbanned Mr. Gay Fogs. Yeah, he is. He he is unbanned off of Twitter. So he is banned. He is unbanned off of Twitter. I think as well. Okay, so yeah, he's un he's unbanned off of Twitter. Elon Musk is allowing him to be on there. Whereas you know, in twenty twenty one, he you know when he bought actually not twenty twenty last year when he said bought he's like no way we're not unbanning this guy and then he realized that you know if we want everybody to speak I guess we gotta let everybody speak. Alex Jones is probably one of the craziest people in the world where you know, but again, he's unbanned on for Twitter so yeah. But Disney of course is halting any advertising for Twitter. But I don't really think Disney's ads really matter all too much for Twitter. Almost certainly, given the fact that Disney is becoming a dead brand overall, Disney's gonna probably try to save themselves next year, but I don't really count on it. Okay, Disney is a dying company, and I don't think Elon Musk really gives a crap about Disney's advertising, considering the fact that Disney has had one of the worst box offices of all of the companies. Even like, even like for example, Warner Brothers was to probably be one up. I wish they had the Barbie movie movies and they had the Nun movie movies, which made a lot of money. Only movies that were flopped by Warner Bros. were non-franchise movies and, of course, the DC superhero movies as well. 
You know, that was the only major flop by Warner Brothers this year. But Disney, every single major movie has flopped. And that's about this video here. Goodbye.